Hey everyone, happy Friday. Thanks so much for clicking on. We've got pretty quiet weather conditions in the tropics going on in both the Atlantic Basin and even in the Pacific to a degree. So we want to check out both basins and the big story the next couple of days going to be what's going on with the Saharan dust. We're tracking a plume that's come off the coast of Africa and that's going to be heading our direction as we get through the upcoming weekend and into early next week. You'll notice by the time we get into Sunday, Monday, Tuesday and even into Wednesday of next week, that dust plume going to be working its way closer and closer to our area and that could be a little problematic for you, uh, especially if you have respiratory issues. Dust is an irritant, so that does tend to throw uh, a wrench into uh, folks that have sensitive uh, activity to that kind of thing. Uh, your throat, your eyes could be a little bit itchy because of that. Also going to help suppress any tropical activity. We don't have anything to speak of out there across the Atlantic Basin right now. And with that plume of dust, it looks like that trend going to continue for us as we get through the next several days as well. Along with the Saharan dust, we do have hazier sunrises and sunsets. And you'll notice uh, almost a milky color to the sky as we get through the next couple of days with that dust cloud coming on into the mix. But because of the Saharan dust. We're not anticipating any tropical cyclone formation in the next five days across the Atlantic Basin, but the Pacific Basin, that's where we do have something that we're watching right now. Of course, not a concern for us here across Texas or even across the United States, but our friends down across Southwest Mexico, if you've got any friends that are maybe vacationing in Acapulco or, or here across the uh, southwestern part of Mexico, it's going to be spreading in some pretty big waves the next couple of days and also some unsettled weather a possibility across those locations as well. So certainly something we'll be monitoring, but again, not a concern for us here across Texas and things certainly remaining quiet. So some good news there as well. You can always download the Fox 26 weather app and get the very latest here across the tropics and also here at home at any time.